Hi, I'm Adam. I'm Ben. And this is how we built the Black Wing Adjustable Bench. To create this bench, we combined the best qualities from our top tier benches to make the ultimate flat incline decline bench, the Black Wing Adjustable Bench. This hybrid FID bench combines the functionality of our patented zero gap technology and the closed ladder system of our AB5200. It features 12 back pad adjustments along with six seat pad adjustments, which coupled with our unique angled pop pin makes those adjustments quick and easy. It also has our clean grip pads and is compatible with our leg roller so that way you have even more exercise options and it has more features. Let's get into that. We put our engineers to work on this bench, focusing on some of the finer details. Those being some laser cut detailing on the stainless steel plates on the front of the bench, laser cut numbering on the back ladder, along with the laser cut rep logo and the embossed mountain logo on the front. That coupled with the stainless steel handles on both the front handle and back ladder and black hardware that look great on any color. The Black Wing weighs 131 pounds, is made of 11 gauge steel and has a weight capacity of 1,000 pounds. So you're set anytime you step up for a PR. We've also taken several steps to improve the overall stability of this bench versus some others. We did that by widening the back foot and also developing a new wider front foot. Both of these do not really add much to the overall footprint though. The other thing we did is we increased some tolerances on all of the hinge points to significantly minimize any side to side wobble. Now those tighter tolerances on the hinge points make it so this back pad is locked in so tight that if I was gonna wobble this bench, I'm gonna have to tilt the whole thing. At the base, we've got grooved rubber rear feet and a protective liner on the front foot, which provides extra grip to keep your bench in place while also protecting your floors. We've also improved the protective liner on the ladder system, and it comes with a protective liner on the integrated vertical storage. Speaking more to the adjustability of the Blackwing, the 12 back pad angles range from negative eight all the way up to 85. And to easily adjust the back pad, I simply pull up, select my angle, say 45 degrees, come to the seat and utilizing that angled pop pin, which unlike other pop pin adjustable benches, where I would need to pull that pin to adjust the pad up, all I need to do is grab the front, two clicks, and I'm at the angle I desire. Now, to move the pad back down, I do have to pull that pin and reset it. The zero gap feature allows you to eliminate the gap between the back and the seat pad in any position. The new design puts it on the side, making it easier to adjust, and also comes with an updated metal spring pin for a premium feel. Now the Blackwing can independently decline without the need for a leg roller attachment, as we have shown here. So it's at negative eight degrees, which through our product testing, we found is the optimal angle to still hit the chest really well while being able to keep your feet on the floor for a good leg drive. Now, if I wanted to increase the angle of my decline, that's where I can bring the leg roller attachment in and I can do my decline going in the other direction, which we'll demonstrate for you now. Now they have the optional leg roller attached, you can perform movements like decline press, decline sit-ups, or any other decline movements you could think of. And we have it set up here in negative 10 degrees. And you can go up a little bit higher to negative 15 degrees with both the seat pad and then the positive 15 degrees on the back pad. And you can even go higher than that with the back pad if you want to get a really serious decline sit-up in. Also, well, another cool feature with the leg roller and another cool exercise you can do is if you flip it over, you can perform Nordic hamstring curls. And we'll demonstrate that for you in this video. So we have the leg roller oriented here to show how you'd position it for a Nordic hamstring curl while in the flat position. Now a really unique benefit of being able to do the negative eight from the back pad is that I can drop this down, lift the seat pad up, and now I can kind of scale my Nordic hamstring curl if I'm working towards getting one all the way to that flat position. Talking about our new clean grip pads, it took us over a year to develop, but they are now firmer grippier and easier to clean. We offer them in a standard 12 inch option as well as a 14 inch wide option. And now the pads when in flat position match IPF specification, height, width, and length. Speaking to the maneuverability and storage of this bench, a horizontal knurled stainless steel handle makes this very easy to move around even at 131 pounds, kicks right up on the vertical storage. Now, 
When you go to store this vertically, it's really important that you make sure that this seat gap is closed all the way before kicking it up. And now while this bench is stored upright, it only takes up 3.1 square feet of space and the closed ladder makes it so the back pad isn't gonna go anywhere. We hope you love the black wing adjustable bench as much as we do, so you can get your stealth on while chasing after all your PRs. And as always, if you have any questions at all, feel free to reach out to our Colorado-based customer service team. And Ben, you can be my wingman anytime. Bullshit, you can be mine. <laughs> <laughs>